Water mapping is, is uh, one of the important keys that they found out in the latest UL study that came out last year. Um, it's the, the correct way to cool a room and its contents, uh, potential victims, um, under fire conditions to quickly extinguish and safely for uh, civilians that could be inside um, extinguish fire. But the first thing we know in, in fire behavior is that the most dangerous components of combustion are at the ceiling. That's why when we come interior, we come at a high steep angle. We're gonna start at that, sweeping left, right, or right to left, doesn't matter, but starting at the ceiling, back and forth, continuing down your, your stream, hitting a wall, coming back up, hitting the ceiling again, back and forth, coming to the opposing wall, water mapping down that wall, and periodically sweeping the floor to cover the surface of the floor as well. Some of that is gonna come down from the walls and the ceiling, but we wanna make sure, because that also uh, get us another application where it, it uh, will clear any of the debris that might be in front of the fire fire. One of the conditions that we have to be really aware of is, is flashover, pre-flashover. We need to be able to recognize those conditions, but one of the ways that the nozzle person can combat that is by water mapping, covering the ceiling and the techniques as we talk back and forth. That's where that, that most the flashover potential is the greatest, uh, up high, hitting that back and forth. And then we're gonna absolutely cover all the surfaces within the room, the wall, the ceiling, uh, anything, in, anything inside as far as even furniture and stuff.